name is Gerald Lucio. I'm 67 years old. Been cutting hair for 43 years. Where are you from? To Floresville, Texas. Is there a specific haircut you do a lot? Regular haircut. You know, nothing fancy and nothing crazy. What do you look, to, what do you look forward to every day in the shop? Money. Have customers and make money. Strictly walk-ins and cash. I get a boss for 10 minutes and he's gone. Yeah. Have you ever messed up people's hair? All the time. It's just part of the business, you know. It depends. Start complaining. You don't like it? There it is. There's okay. first customer. No. I mean, that's just a lot of times you see, you might mess people up because they ask you one thing. I think the biggest problem with people is they don't know how to come across with, I want it this way or I want it that way. And the barber has, is the one that has to figure it out. How did your first haircut go? Can you tell me the story? Very good. It was my dad. <laughs> but when, uh, when we moved over here as a business, it was my dad that was my first customer of the day and the only customer that day. That was like 38 years ago and some change. Uh, since COVID, you know, it's, it's slowed down. But before COVID, we were busy, I would say, 80% of the day. And there's times that we're busy 100% of the day. Big weeks are holiday weekends, like a Easter Sunday, Christmas, uh, Thanksgiving. Those are just big weeks, big uh, weeks. Let's do a brief explanation about your journey. Uh, I want to die behind the barber chair. How's that? <laughs> this guy, this guy's got, this guy's got a family of barbers. Him, his wife, his sons, his daughters. I'm Garcia. I'm 64 years old and cutting hair for 22 years. Where are you from? San Antonio. Is there a specific haircut you do a lot? Uh, all kinds, really. High and tight, high and tight, and basic haircut. Well, it started off with my wife being a hairdresser. And once I, once I. I got it. I said my daughter got in there when she was a teenager, and then I got in it when couldn't do no more warehouse work. Uh, it's easy money. This is the heaviest tool you got to pick up. It's easy money. If you're good at it. <laughs> How's that, sir? Do you like it? Oh yeah. Are you sure? Uh-huh. Okay, good. <laughs> to a guy that can go out tonight and have fun. And not be burning up with all the hair. You're not going to get a haircut, right, Micah? Oh, come on. Thank you. Yes, you have a great time at the game.